Alrighty, so I'm gonna do something a little different today. I'm going to do my prediction video for the third coaster in the Cedar Fair chain for 2019. Yes, third, only third, because I only think three coasters are coming to Cedar Fair next year. Um, this is because on the stockholder call, they said that they weren't gonna build four coasters for a while um, after the 2018 season. So I am, we already know that Carowinds is getting their mock double launch coaster, and we know that Canada's Wonderland is getting a dive coaster, both very large attractions. So they're eating away at the budget already with that. So in this video, I'm going to discuss which park and which coasters I think are possible for the Cedar Fair chain in 2019. So let's get right into it. We already know that Canada's Wonderland is off to quite the start on their construction project um, with their footers already laid for the station, brake run and transfer track. Carowinds is also off to a really fast start um, out of nowhere. They're digging footers, prepping water work and doing large land clearing. A Mac coaster for Carowinds is absolutely insane, and I am so jealous for this Mach double launch coaster. And it is awesome that Mach is finally working with Cedar Fair and back in North America. I can't wait to see what other parks get a Mach coaster. I mean, there's 2020, there's 2021, 2022. Which parks are gonna get the next Mach coaster? I mean, Cedar Point's 150th anniversary is coming up. Let's not exclude Mach out of that equation. And then there's other big parks like Kings Island, Kings Dominion, Carowinds, Knott's Berry Farm. What's going to happen? But anyways, let's get right to the point. Um, so you have a bunch of parks in the Cedar Fair chain and you have them split into what I like to call two or three categories. You have your larger parks, you have your medium sized parks, and then you have your small scale parks. And 2019 may be a small park year. Okay, so Kings Dominion, um, Cedar Point, Knott's Berry Farm, and California's Great America all got a coaster in 2018. They are excluded from the 2019 season. Canada's Wonderland and Carowinds are also excluded in this um, as they are getting coasters in 2019 already, so they're not getting two. So that leaves Michigan's Adventure, Valley Fair, um, Worlds of Fun, and Dorney Park. Kings Island isn't getting a big coaster in 2019, so they're excluded as well, um, as that would be a big coaster park, and there's not going to be three large coasters in 2019. So, Worlds of Fun, Valley Fair, Michigan's Adventure, and Dorney Park. Now, we all know Michigan's Adventure probably isn't getting a coaster in 2019, so I'm going to exclude them from the list, unfortunately. I'm so sorry if you're watching this video and you're a Michigan's Adventure fan. Now, just remember, this is just a speculation video. I don't know what's going on, so don't take this too seriously. Um, that doesn't mean that they're 100% excluded until park announcements in um, August. So stay tuned. Don't worry. Don't panic. Um, but... I think Worlds of Fun, Valley Fair, and Dorney Park are probably the top contenders. And we have to look at Worlds of Fun's um, lodging as like a bonus for them higher up on the list. Um, and Valley Fair was just mentioned in a stockholder call to be on the list for expansion moving forward, just like California's Great America. They are eyeing that park due to an increase in season pass sales and increase in attendance. This is great for that park, so keep an eye out on that park for future investments. That doesn't necessarily mean it's coming in 2019 because it is just being mentioned now. I do think out of these three parks, it is extremely difficult to figure out which park is getting what in 2019. Which of these three parks is getting a coaster? Are you guys struggling to figure out which one it, um, like I am? Like I'm, I'm stuck on Dorney. Like I really am stuck on Dorney. I think that Dorney Park is going to be it because they have removed an attraction and we know anytime Cedar Fair removes an attraction, it usually means it's going to be replaced, whether that be a year, two, or three years down the road, it is going to be replaced. Valley Fair, being mentioned on the call, puts it high up on the list too, so I'm struggling to like fully pick which park I think is going to be the 2019 coaster. Worlds of Fun has lodging, meaning it does need extra investments to keep guests coming, so that is high up on the list too. Again, I'm not helping my case right now in deciding which park is getting a 2019 coaster. Um, I'm going to go with Dorney Park. And the reason I'm going to go with Dorney Park is because they removed an attraction. It's been high up on the rumor mill. Um, and they really need that coaster. 
Um, I think Valley Fair and Worlds of Fun is going to be in the next two to three years if they were to get a coaster. Worlds of Fun is more a family park and they've been adding family attractions and it's been working well for them. Now, Michigan's Adventure. Michigan's Adventure, why I've excluded it, is because Michigan's Adventure is literally locked between Canada's Wonderland, Kings Island, and Cedar Point. There isn't much room or need for a coaster in this park. It doesn't need one. Um, it would just be kind of cannibalizing the people traveling from Michigan to Ohio and Toronto to go to those bigger parks. Um, so maybe they'll get a petting zoo again and upgrade to petting zoo. Um, <laughs> Maybe the petting zoo will become too intense for guest number one. I'm kidding. Maybe they'll get some park infrastructure, like park benches, other things like the typical enthusiast jokes around about this park with. Who knows? Maybe they'll get time warp from Canada's Wonderland. Um, I say that interestingly enough because I do feel like Canada's Wonderland is about to start removing a few of their smaller scale attractions. And I feel like this is the case with a lot of bigger Cedar Fair chains. There are attractions at these chains that cannot handle current attendance levels. So they'll be shipped off to Michigan's Adventure. Or maybe they'll just be stuck with Jake Paul causing a kerfuffle in the park like they did at Carolyn's. Who knows what that park's going to get. Anyways, Delirious and these Super Loops are probably going to be added to a lot of Cedar Fair chains moving forward. And maybe this will be added to Valley Fair and Dorney Park, or sorry, Worlds of Fun and Dorney Park. Valley Fair just got one. Um, and uh, maybe more Cedar Fair chains as well as they're easy to install attractions and very low on cost. But this is the attraction I think everyone's looking at. And this is my prediction for 2019. I think we're going to see another one. And I think Dorney Park may be the home of this next Raptor coaster. These coasters are absolutely stunning. I would love to see these at all the smaller scale and even maybe medium sized parks in the Cedar Fair chain. Look at that station. Look at that theming. It's absolutely gorgeous. And these, from what I am hearing, are super high thrill attractions. Can you imagine one of these at Dorney Park, Worlds of Fun, or even Valley Fair? They would increase attendance greatly. The guests, the general public, and the enthusiasts would all love it. And it's a win-win. So why not? They're very cheap as well. Um, I know there's some problems going on with them, but what new coaster doesn't have those little hiccups? So I expect to see this at Dorney Park. So again, my final prediction for 2019 is I think Dorney Park will be the park that gets a coaster in 2019 due to ride removals um, or removal. Let's not go plural now. Um, and it'll probably be a Raptor coaster. Cheap to install. It's the third coaster in the 2019 season. It's not taking away from the budget um, too much. And that allows Cedar Fair to kind of put other smaller investments in the other parks that aren't getting a coaster. Now, guys, what do you think? Do you think Valley Fair, Worlds of Fun, or Dorney Park is getting a coaster in 2019? Do you agree or disagree with me? Is it going to be a Raptor or is it going to be something else? I want to hear from you down below. What do you guys think? Raptor coaster or something else and at which of these three parks I know that a lot of you probably may not agree with me to what's coming in 2019 and that's fair I have no idea what's going on I'm just making a prediction I'm interested in what you guys have to say and do you guys agree with me on Michigan's adventure do you think Michigan's adventure may actually end up getting a coaster in 2019 who knows this is all fun we have two pieces of the puzzle already filled in and i think the third one will start to get an idea of which park that will be very shortly construction's got to start at some point right um anyways hopefully you guys enjoyed this video um hopefully you guys really enjoy my speculation videos this is something new for me i've never like done one of these like prediction videos for other parks i found it super fun i can't wait to make more um maybe i'll do a cedar fair 2019 editions prediction video sometime soon anyways again hopefully you guys enjoyed this video give the video a like subscribe if you haven't share the video and head on over to patreon for exclusive content we are doing much more on there now and i can't wait to expand it even more anyways guys don't forget to comment down below have a great one bye